Welcome to my Saturday inspiration. God has made me to perspire, me to sweat, go through various battles so that I can inspire people by His grace. Okay, one of your after lessons today, number one is one of your greatest regrets in life would be that you are trying to be what others want you to be rather than being yourself. Don't struggle to be like others. Sometimes in life, you swim against the current to get to the shore. That is why the Bible describes you as an ego. Egos fly alone. Egos don't seek crowds. Until other people make you happy, you cannot be happy. People's opinion on you will vary. Nobody will love you. It is not their job. It is your job to love yourself first. If they love you, praise God. If they don't, praise God. They criticize you, praise God. If they don't, praise God. Don't let people's views of you, their attacks on you, weigh you down. Don't let their praises of you make you to be excited. No. Believe in yourself. Strong lions hunt alone. Chickens flock together. Eagles fly alone. That's why they have the strongest wings on earth. During this pandemic, one of the greatest lessons the world learned is that people died lonely, cold deaths because various governments didn't allow people to visit their loved ones at the final hour. So they died alone. And when I look at life, really, you were born alone. And truly, most people will, will, will be buried alone. And God will judge you alone. You must learn to start believing in yourself. Don't wait for others to make you happy. The secret of your joy is in your hand. In fact, the world will make you sad. Out of envy, believe in yourself. That was why the most painful word to me was when the Prime Minister of Holland, his own mother, Matt Root, is the uh, 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 Netherlands uh, Prime Minister. The mother was dying, but he, as the Prime Minister, could not go and see her in the hospital. She died alone. There were so many missing goodbyes in this pandemic. Lonely deaths. Don't forget it. Believe in yourself. Don't seek for the crowd. Most times you will walk alone if you want to be great. That's why you must learn to spend time with God in your quiet time. Learn to be comfortable with yourself and your God. Friendship is good, but learn this lesson that I was born alone. Even if you are twins, you were born alone. You will die alone. You will be judged alone. Mark 12 says, I think verse 31, he says, there's no other commandment. There are two. Love the Lord your God and love your neighbor as yourself. He said there is no other commandment bigger than this. So if you don't love yourself, you are disobeying God. If you wait for somebody to say, hey, you are looking fine today, before you are happy, you are disobeying God. He said no other commandments are bigger than this. Love the Lord your God and then love your neighbor as yourself. So there are three commandments there. One, love your neighbor. He, he could have stopped there, but Jesus said, ask yourself. He added you into the equation. Love God, love yourself, love your neighbor. But don't allow your neighbor or your friends to influence who you become. Don't allow the enemy to make you, we call them harvest attackers. You labor and labor and labor and labor and labor and labor. Then they attack you when you are about to eat the fruit of your labor. They take honey from your mouth on the last minute. You sweat to create honey like a bee. But at the last day or hour before your celebration, they attack you. And when you go to Mana YouTube, uh, uh, Mana TV International on YouTube, all these inspirations are there for you. Tell your friends about it. Forward this video to somebody. They cannot give you vinegar in place of honey. You will eat the fruit of your labor. Disappointment at the edge of breakthrough. We go. When Sarah was about to eat the fruit of her labor, she was gone. She was in the grave. We are going to deal with that this Sunday. So you go, you go to Facebook, our Daily Man Online, 
you will see most of our teachings there on my teachings on is to inspire you. I want you great. God wants you great. So these are my two lessons today. Our daily manner online for Facebook and Mana YouTube, Mana TV International on YouTube this Sunday, 8 a.m., 8.30, 9.30, 10.30. Three services. And all the past services are all in these sites. I just named for you. Father, in the name of Jesus, she, he will not walk and labor for others to eat. I pray for you. You will be there at your celebration hour. Nobody will represent you at your season of glory. They will not say, oh, she's missing, he's missing. At your hour to eat honey, you will suck honey for the, from the fleet of the rock. And you cannot be stopped. See you on Sunday. And you can check most of these messages on Sunday and these inspirations. YouTube Mana TV International and our daily manner online Facebook. And until then, until this Sunday, be ready to pray. I love you. For this video, help somebody and let us make it together and celebrate at our season. And nobody will take honey from your mouth. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen.